Welcome back to part two. Today we're going to rock three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight packs. So one day soon I'm going to go through my storage. I'm going to bust out all my original cards that I have. And I'll figure out a way to give those out to someone. So hopefully we'll create a full set from here, if not one or two full sets, then the full set that I have in storage. That's a cool one. So I'll find a way to, to give those out, send those away to my subscribers. So be sure to participate, like the videos, comment on the videos, subscribe to the channel, share the videos. The more active people, I'll, I will uh, favoritize. Such cool, I got them before. I like giving things out randomly, but I also like to reward those who participate. Oh, 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 do we have our first? We have our first Crow Vision Chase card. Let's look at it last. It's actually been a while since I've watched this movie. I want to show it to my daughter one of these days, but I still think she's a little too young for it. She's 12 going on 13. I was just about to tell you guys what I got her for her birthday which is sort of related to The Crow, something I got her several years ago, but she might actually watch this channel, so I'm not going to tell you. Oh, I missed a card. Here we go. Biling so cute. There, that one. All right, so this is my first Crow Vision Chase card that I've ever seen and or ever owned, so that's cool. Psychic Link. Collect all ten. Ba boom And that's pretty lame. So the crow vision was the thing they did in the film where they took the image and they kind of distorted it and made it all wavy, which supposedly was a pretty pricey thing to do back then. That's how the image is kind of elongated there. So, so the numbers these numbered at all? So these aren't numbered, but this is it's at least 10 of those. So we'll leave that out there. So I know for a fact, I years ago I bought a box of the Crow Seed of Angels trading cards as I might have mentioned on another video. And I thought it was really kind of lame how as I opened them up, all the cards are in sequence. And it's like I'd get like two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then the next set would be eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. And so there's really almost no guessing or no randomness. Let's take a look at these. I hate to see if these, do I don't think these are doing the same thing. Are these even freaking numbered? Left all 100 number there. Let's see a number. Oh, duh, right there. The number is right there. 73, 37, 46, 55. Yeah, it's seeming like it's not doing the same thing as the number there. Okay, number there. Look. Look. We're learning something together. Psychic link. That's number nine. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. Already seeing a lot of doubles. Disconcerting. Michael Messi sadly passed away a few years ago. I think 2017, that guy right there. He actually went to the same fraternity as the guy I went to school with at KU in Lawrence, Kansas. Can't tell you the name of the fraternity because I just don't remember what it was. I wasn't there in the fraternity, just a friend of mine. Seen that one before, seen that one before, seen that one before. Seen that one before. I think that's new. So I have different lights on. I have a light on up here. I think it's giving me more reflection because I don't think I don't remember seeing my reflection in the Batman cards I was doing. If I remember correctly, in, in the that's actually a raven. They use ravens in the movie because ravens are actually bigger and crows are actually smaller. Cool scene. That's two of the same character right in a row. That dude is like this tall in real life. I don't know if you know that or not. 
You'll probably be seeing him later on when I do a series of Twin Peaks trading cards because he was in Twin Peaks. And I say, damn, what's the line? Shoot me. Move and you're dead. And he says, uh, and I say I'm dead and I move. I thought I'd go, boom. That one's cool. Two more to rock out. It's already hard to believe this movie is 27 years old. Ooh, 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 ooh. Exciting. Crow Meum card. Chromium number six. That is an original. Hey, look at me. James Zobar design right there. Nice. Cool. My first chromium card. Oh, no, wait. Yeah, is that what I said? <laughs> Another cool image. Ernie freaking Hudson. Ernie Hudson is an underrated actor, I think. Yeah, he's in a lot of classics, but he's also in a lot of really great unknown, not really unknown, but like kind of independent movies. Like he's in The Crow, which is one of my favorites. He's in The Basketball Diaries, which is one of my favorites. Both of which I have 35 millimeter trailers for signed by somebody in the movie. I have an original Crow 35 millimeter trailer autographed by James Obar. And then Basketball Diaries, I have an original 35 millimeter trailer signed by James Medeo. That's a good shot right there. Ooh. Cool one. Ow. Yeah, didn't we see that before? Yeah, I think we did. That's a new one. Seen that one. Seen that one. Seen that one. All right. So that was a lot better than the first video. So we got Crow Vision card, and we got a Crow Meme card. My first two Chase cards I've had of this series. Pretty sweet. Later.